We, we have uh, for the past uh, six, seven, eight years been doing cataract surgery, uh, med readies, medical readiness training exercises here in Santo Domingo at the military hospital. Uh, and every year we bring in patients from throughout the Dominican Republic who are in need of cataract surgery. That need is met by doctors at a particular hospital in Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic. But they have some, a, this is a residency training program at this hospital, so this is a, they have eight residents. Um, so that's part of our mission in Tracula BSS, to train them to do the, uh, this type of a surgery. The willingness of the American doctors to teach them the techniques and let them work hands on so they're really happy about it. It's been amazing. They've been super nice. Um, they teach you, they're very patient, um, trying to teach us the techniques that they're used. And they're, they're like super nice. They've been super awesome. <laughs> that teamwork produces life-changing results. There's nothing more satisfying than seeing the look on a parent's face when you've made their child's eyes straight or certainly the look on somebody's face who couldn't see, and the next day, the light of day has kind of dawned on them with a, you know, in a new and, and personal way. But things like this, you know, no matter where we go, even in countries that, that the U.S. image isn't that good, and we do what we do here, we do something that's good, that's helping people see um, with really no expectations, no, no real secondary gain for us, that helps project a good image for the United States and the United States military. Reporting from the Dominican Republic, I'm Sergeant Daylon Douglas, Army South Public Affairs.